Sweetie, how much does your tag say? Zero dollars. Oh no, honey, you're worthless. You must hide it. Everyone will judge you based on how much you're worth. Job interviews, applying to college, making friends, or getting a boyfriend. They'll all look at your price tag. Mommy, I don't think that's true. Just because my tag says zero doesn't mean people won't want to be my friends. Okay, go and see for yourself. Hey guys, let's go play princesses together. Oh my gosh, you're worth zero dollars. I'm worth a million. I'm worth a billion. You can't play with us. We don't want to be seen playing with anyone who's worthless. Ha oh. <laughs> ha you're so mean. <laughs> hey, Brianna. Timmy. Jake's having a party letter tonight. He wanted to know if you'd come. Yes, I would love to. That sounds like so much fun. Sweet, but I just need to take a picture of your price tag real quick. All the guests have to be worth at least 10000 I can't show you, Timmy. Why not? Why do you even hide it anyways? You're my best friend. You wouldn't tell anyone, right? No, of course not. Okay. You're worthless! You're worthless! I can't believe you're... Shh! Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. Hey, Bree, what's good? Hi, Jake. Hey, Jake. You're coming to my party tonight, right? Of course, I wouldn't miss it for the world. Great, I can't wait to see you there. Wow, Jake, your muscles look really big today. Mine are way better. Want to feel? Yeah, I would love... No way, Timmy just sent me a picture of your tag. It says zero dollars. You're worthless. Get away from me, Brianna. I can't believe I was talking to someone who's worthless. Brianna's worthless. Thanks for the heads up, Timmy. Timmy, I wouldn't hang around her if I were you. She's worthless. Timmy, why would you do that? You're my best friend. I thought I could trust you. Bri, let me explain. It's because I'm in love with you. What? Do you have any idea how it made me feel seeing you flirt with Jake all the time? I'm sorry I showed the whole school your secret, but... Now the only person that wants you is me. It doesn't matter how worthless I am, Timmy. I still would never date you. You're going to wish you had dated me. Because no one wants to be seen with someone who's worthless like you. Ew, the worthless girl's in our classroom. Ew, get her out of here. I'm worth a million dollars, but I can feel my worth decreasing with her just sitting there. Why is everyone saying Brianna's worthless? She's not. She's priceless. They put a zero because they can't put a dollar amount on someone who's priceless. She has the highest amount of worth there is. You're all very lucky to be in the same classroom with her because there's very few people in this world who are priceless like her. No way, it's the priceless girl. Take photos of her. She has the highest worth. You know you should be thanking me, Brianna. Thanking you? Yeah, if I didn't share the photo of your price tag to the whole school, you would have always thought you're just worthless. I know my worth, Timmy, and I don't need some tag to tell me. Brianna. Jake. I can't believe you're priceless. That's amazing. I mean, before, when I thought you were worthless, I would have never wanted to date you, but now I'd like to take you out on a date. Jake, I... Aw, oh, you're so silly putting stickers on your face. <laughs> no! You killed your big sister! You can't ever laugh. It kills people. Look what you've done! Sissy! Here, before coming into the classroom, you must put this tape over your mouth. Why? It's a precaution issued by the school board, as kids are the highest risk for laughter. I don't want to wear the tape anymore. You must wear it. <laughs> We're just kids. He didn't do it on purpose. Listen, kid. I saved your life. You could have died. You should be thanking me. Mommy, you forgot to pick me up from school. Good evening. Police officer. There was an incident of laughing at your mother's work. She didn't make it. Stop laughing. <laughs> Stop laughing. What's going on here? You killed Officer Brad. Uh oh, we're going to need backup. Did you hear? She killed three police officers when she was seven. You know I can hear you, right? I was just a kid. I was traumatized from my mom just passing away. I couldn't control it. You're a murderer. A psycho. I can't listen to this any longer. Hey, are you okay? I can't believe what they're saying about you. I'm used to it. Want to hang out after school? There's somewhere I want to show you. We're almost there. Where are you taking me? We're here. In the middle of nowhere? You know those three police officers you killed? One of them was my dad. <laughs> Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh, man! Ha! Rock beat scissors. Round two? Rock, Rock paper, scissors. scissors. Rock wins? Ah. Rock, paper... No, 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 no. What? I'm not playing the third round. Come on, one of us will win a million dollars. Yeah, but one of us will die. That's a risk I'm willing to take. I'm not.
Hello? The results came in. I have cancer. What? Treatment's going to be very expensive. And I'm too sick to work. We're going to lose our house soon. I don't know how we'll live. Mom, don't worry about a thing. I'll get us all the money we need. Derek, let's play rock, paper, scissors. If we tie the first two rounds, I'll play the third round with you. Rock, rock paper, paper scissors. scissors. I win. Rock, rock paper, paper, scissors. Paper beats rock. Last round. Rock, rock paper, rock, rock, paper, scissors. scissors. We both chose paper. We'll have to play again. How about we split the money? No way. I'm not splitting the money. I want the million all for myself. Derek, I don't want to die, and I don't want to see you die. I'm not splitting. Rock, paper, scissors. There's no way. Scissors beats paper. You cheated. You're a cheater. I didn't cheat. Come with me, Derek. We're taking you to be executed. Oh, she didn't win fairly. She cheated. Did you hear? She killed Derek for a million dollars. I didn't kill Derek. We played a game we both agreed to, and I won. There she is. I've been looking for you everywhere. Ma'am, is everything okay? I'm Derek's mother. I want to avenge my son. We're playing rock, paper, scissors till the third round. Okay, I'll play with you. Rock, paper... paper. Wait, stop the game. I can't wear these anymore. You have to smile, or I'm going to put the clothing pins back on, okay? Okay. Honey, you know I'm doing this because I love you, right? If you get caught not smiling, you'll be executed. Yeah. You just see walking. Ah! You made me fall. Oh, sorry, sissy. <laughs> I think I broke my leg. Sissy, <laughs> you're not smiling. We have a code red. Hurry. Smile. You look so beautiful when you smile, babe. Well, that's good, because that's all we're allowed to do, so... My mother was just executed. Baby, you're not smiling. Smile. I can't believe she's gone. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Baby, they're watching. Hurry up, smile. <coughs> Baby, smile. We've got a code red. Okay, okay, I'm smiling, I'm smiling! Your smile's looking a little low today. Yeah, it is. We're going to have to use the clothing pins again. You need a much wider smile than that. Hey, Brie. Hey, Bestie, your smile's looking a little low. Here, try these clothing pins. It's a trick my mom taught me. You put it right here. What's even the point anymore? Bessie, you need to smile. I can't lose you, too. We've got a code red. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. I'm smiling. I'm smiling. We'll let you off with a warning. A warning? They never got a warning. My boyfriend, my best friend, my five-year-old sister. Your mother would be very upset you're acting this way. My mother? Yeah, the creator of the Smiling Law. She told us to show no mercy to her children, but I figured she'd be upset if both her daughters were gone. Mother. Where's your smile? You're the creator of the Smiling Law. Is that a problem, honey? Think of all the people that died because of you. Little sister, she was only five years old. And she didn't obey the law, and neither did you. Where are the police? You're a monster. Looks like I'm going to have to get rid of you myself. Come on, honey. You've already lost everyone. You really want to lose your mother, too? You're the only one I wanted to lose. Aw, oh, you're so silly putting stickers on your face. <laughs> no! You killed your big sister! You can't ever laugh. It kills people. Look what you've done! Sissy! Here, before coming into the classroom, you must put this tape over your mouth. Why? It's a precaution issued by the school board, as kids are the highest risk for laughter. I don't want to wear the tape anymore. You must wear it. <laughs> We're just kids. You didn't do it on purpose. Listen, kid. I saved your life. You could have died. You should be thanking me. Mommy, you forgot to pick me up from school. Good evening. Police officer. There was an incident of laughing at your mother's work. She didn't make it. Stop laughing. Stop laughing. 
<laughs> What's going on here? You killed Officer Brad! Uh oh. We're gonna need backup. Did you hear? She killed three police officers when she was seven. You know I can hear you, right? I was just a kid. I was traumatized from my mom just passing away. I couldn't control it. You're a murderer. A psycho. I can't listen to this any longer. Hey, are you okay? I can't believe what they're saying about you. I'm used to it. Want to hang out after school? There's somewhere I want to show you. We're almost there. Where are you taking me? We're here. In the middle of nowhere? You know those three police officers you killed? One of them was my dad. <laughs> your soulmate candy cane! Mm. No, don't eat it! You need it to find your soulmate. Only your soulmate's candy cane will match with yours, making a heart. But every year you'll only be given the candy cane for the month of December. So I only get one month to find my soulmate every year? Yes, so you better get looking. Hi, Bree. See me. Let me see your candy cane. Let's see if we're soulmates. Does it match? No, too big. You broke my candy cane. It's finally the month of December. It's time to look for our soulmates. This year is going to be the year I find my soulmate. I just know it. Jake, let me see your candy cane. Is it a match? It's too small. Uh, size doesn't matter. In this case, it does. What? It's December 31st already, and I still haven't found anyone that matches my candy cane. Hey, Brie. I'm having a New Year's party. Everyone's invited. Want to come through? New Year's party. That's a perfect place to meet your soulmate. There's a drink. Time to party. No time for chit-chat. I need to find who matches my candy cane. Kevin, can I see your candy cane? Let's see if we're soulmates. I ate mine by mistake. Brianna, do you want a drink? Let me see your candy cane. I'm going to have to pass on that drink. Can you at least try to enjoy the party? I've tried everyone here. No one matches my candy cane. Attention everyone, the new year is in one minute. It's almost January 1st. That means I haven't found my soulmate this year again. You've made this entire night about you and finding your soulmate. You completely wasted my New Year's Eve. You're right, I'm sorry. So you never found your soulmate? Nope, I never did. But I realized there's more to life than finding your soulmate. Are you telling stories again? My best friend never found her soulmate either. Yep, I still have my candy cane. It's always been you.